Hello everyone, my name is Asim and welcome back to another video on Extreme Gaming Fever. So guys, in today's video we are going to talk about the new update of Farming Simulator 20. So this is a little bit different update than we usually, you know, get to see the new update of Farming Simulator 20. We get to see new content being added in the new update. So this time there is no content or you may say it's not a free content update but it's more like a bug fix update or something like that so i will come to that uh, what is fixed in this uh, update so first of all uh, <laughs> let me give you a hint that it could be the last update of farming simulator 20 it could be so how i will explain later in this video but first of all let's talk about what is fixed in this new update so there is a patch note uh, with this update so i will read out and explain try to explain to you uh, what the you know patch note says so first thing of first thing first uh, let's talk about uh, the first thing in the patch note which says fixed issues on some devices with gamepad uh, with uh, with game switching to gamepad mode even with no gamepad connected so i remember this issue a lot of people uh, in the comment section they often complain that they are not able to uh, play their game on specifically on redmi note 10 device i remember very well so um, for the, for the people who did simply did not had this issue i will try to explain this by, by this way is that uh, basically when the people who have uh, affected device I would call it an affected device because this issue only occur on certain devices not every device was facing this issue so uh, when uh, on a certain device uh, people try to launch their game the uh, when they enter in the game so they were not able to see any controls on their game so the slider let me show you like okay so the slider these sliders they were not showing up on their game so they had no way to move their vehicle forward or you know turn their vehicle so for them the game was totally useless they were not able to play this their game because the game simply switched to controller mode now what is controller mode I have currently connected my Xbox controller with my iPad so I will show you what is the con uh, gamepad mode okay so if I s press any button on my controller let's say I want to change the camera so if I you you know I just simply moved my joystick a little bit and the game entered the control gamepad mode so this is the gamepad mode now the game enter there is a gamepad mode designed in the game so that if you have a controller you connect your controller with your game so the native controls simply disappear to give you uh, more visibility give you more immersive view of the game so there are no controls blocking your view or blocking your screen so this is the gamepad mode and if i touch on the screen the game switches to not gamepad mode or we, uh, switches to native controls where i can use these controls and control my game so for those people who were having this issue their game used to switch to this mode and now you can imagine they had no control over anything so this was the first major thing the developer fixed so by the way this was not <laughs> this was this issue was in the game for quite a long time probably for six to seven months uh, this issue uh, was in the game and finally developers fixed this added help message when driving over triggers what does what is this so let me explain it so let me get out of this structure in order to explain this thing is that okay so let's find our trigger first so if you are not familiar this right here this orange slash yellow whatever you say this this orange or yellow thing is a trigger okay so this is a trigger we call it a, a call it a trigger so previously if i walk over it or drive something over it there was nothing happened okay nothing happened in this game 
So now if I work over it slowly, you can see there is a message right now on the screen, which is right here, which says animal feeding trough, unload food here to feed livestock. So this is the helping message uh, that they added in this new game. I wish they added this thing uh, when they initially, you know, released the game. It could have been so much helpful for the new players, but anyways, still a lot of people a lot of new players comes to farming simulator 20 every month i guess still it's a very helpful thing so this is the new uh, helping uh, help message when whenever you you know go to a trigger a new uh, you, uh, a help message will appear on the screen which tells you what this trigger is for so this trigger as you guys already can see is straw trigger so if i walk over this trigger it says unload straw here to increase the health of your animal so basically straw is used for the bedding of your cows you can see the there is a straw bedding on our in our cow pen and besides that straw also enables your cows to produce manure and liquid manure if you will not unload straw to your cow pen you will not get any manner or liquid manner so you can see right here is manner point load produced manner here and simply for this slurry liquid manner point load produced liquid manner here so liquid manner or slurry is probably i guess same thing if there is a difference let me know in the comments section. so now there is help message on every single trigger okay so let's see what they have added so the next thing is um, a very major thing how I will explain to you right now so if I try to drive my tractor and uh, try to connect the bale collectors oh, by the way the next thing is that fixed unloading bales with Arkison FSX so what what has happened previously in the previous version is that when you use the Arkison FSX bale collector and uh, it was just fine to load bales onto that bale trailer however when you try to unload bales with that bale collector in the previous version uh, the bales simply explodes and the bales uh, you know they spread uh, here and there and this baler was bale collector was a mess creator in other words so i have seen uh, people a screenshot of different people's game in my facebook group where there are there were a lot of bales in their cow pen and they were simply asking now how should how they can remove these bales from cow pen so there was there was no way for them to you know uh, remove those bales from the cow pen it because you cannot enter any tool in the cow pen because because of the you know because of the fence all around the cow pen so this thing is also I guess uh, a huge fix in in this new update and I'm really glad because how how this fix is a big fix let me show you so suppose you are a new player and you come to farming simulator 20 and you want a bale collector so what you would do you will you will see this bale collector okay that's seventy thousand dollars and if you move you see the second option the anderson group stack pro 72000 or 7200 and which is 19000 dollars more expensive than the previous one of course as a new player uh, whereas you are already struggling with your games economy you would definitely prefer the cheaper option right so when you purchase this biller because it's cheaper uh, you did not realize that this biller has uh, this bill collector has a major issue with it so uh, every new player at at some point they purchased this bill collector and they suffered what <laughs> this bill uh, with the mess that this bill collector was creating and that was a big deal for new players because you know they were like whoa what was going on why my bills are exploding into the air because this was funny and painful at the same time because it's funny that the bales were simply exploding in the air and it was painful in um in a manner that uh, your cow pen you know there are a lot of bales 
logged in your cow pen and you are not able to remove them from your cow pen so that that way it was a little bit painful but overall uh, i'm really glad that they fixed this issue and after the third uh, the fourth patch note is that they fixed various bugs and various bugs include some minor bugs and uh, yep that's the new update so now let's talk about how this could be the last update of farming simulator 20 so i will explain but first of all we still have to check if still this bill collector explodes or not we'll see i mean unload bills in explosion or just unload the bales in a normal way so we still have to see this so let's go and go to the trigger here we go moment of truth guys let's see how i guess they have maybe i don't know but i think i'm seeing a change in the game texture as well okay so here we go guys no explosions this time and finally they fix this bale collector by the way this was a very classic bale collector and my favorite as well so i didn't like the anderson group bale collector but this was my favorite and they ruined it because of uh, you know the bug i was not able to use this but now i guess i will use this bale collector more often because it it's it got fixed now so guys in my opinion uh, this is not an official news by the way in my opinion my personal guess is that this could be the last update of farming simulator 20 because uh, the developers did not want to end the updates of their game whereas they knew there were some very serious issues with the with their game so in my opinion they have simply ended their relation with farming simulator 20 and uh, because they don't want to work on this game anymore and if they want to do so they would definitely give us a last update to fix at least every major issue with this game so now we did had some major issues with this game so developers have fixed it and now this game is perfect it's working fine for 99% of devices and um, there is no major issues in this game so we were supposed to get a new content update because we are getting this update right after three months but we did not get any free content so in my opinion my personal guess is that this could be the last update of farming simulator 20 and i think i am expecting a reveal trailer or some news about the next mobile farming simulator game in a month or two so this is my personal guess or my personal opinion once again developers did not say anything about the new mobile farming simulator game so unless there is an official announcement we can just you know simply guess when the new mobile farming simulator game is coming by the way from the podcast conversation uh, the mr lars who works at giant software they did say that in a way i assume that the meaning of the conversation was or the meaning of their sentence was that they are actually working on the new mobile farming simulator game but they are not at a point that they can announce something so that was a month or two a month ago by the way so now we have this probably the final and the last update to farming simulator 20 so i guess it's just a matter of a month or two until we get a news about the next mobile farming simulator game what you guys think about this let me know in the comment section and i will see you in my next video very soon please guys make sure you leave a like for this video and subscribe to my channel if you are new and i will see you in my next video very soon bye bye